Hi, everyone. <laughs> it's me, Ella, from All Writers Welcome, and Charlie. Charlie is really keen for some attention right now, so I apologize if you see a little paw in it. <laughs> Because he's like, hey, why aren't you petting me? So um, I wanted to talk about how to write and market and publish your book in four months. And first, before I get into the how you can do that, I want to talk a little bit about why. So um, why would you want to write and market and publish your book in four months? And so some people, uh, you know, I'm not going to get into the, if, if you don't want to, you don't have to. I'm not trying to pressure anybody into doing that. But I, but if you have thought about it as a possibility, like maybe I do want to. I don't know. Maybe. Let's think about why you might want to. And one of the reasons is because you can complete your work, complete your project. The first reason why you might want to write, market, and publish your book in four months is for that completion of getting something done. And I am, I have totally been bad about this. I have been a person who's like, oh, let me just start a new project, start a new project, start a new project, <laughs> and then, and not completing. And it isn't until in the last year or two, maybe, that I've started completing projects and realizing that there's something extremely extremely satisfying <laughs> about completing something that you've been working on. And so that's the first reason why you might want to write market and publish your book in four months. The other reason is because, um, and somebody on, on, on the other, you know, I had started that comment thread um, a couple days ago and somebody had put it so beautifully. Let me go to that comment. Um, it was Haley, Haley, Haley D. Haley D. Starts with a D. So she said, I'm a big fan of writing quickly. If you write fast, you're writing more books than someone who spends years working on one novel. You're improving your craft at a much faster pace. Ultimately, you'll be better at writing because you've had more practice at it and therefore be able to produce high quality work in a fraction of the time. And she had this, she said, someone in another group shared this allegory that I loved. A pottery teacher <laughs> gave two students one year to make the perfect cup. One student spent the entire year working on the same cup, while the second made a new cup every day. At the end of the year, the second student not only had the better cup, but had perfected the craft so well that they could do it again the next day. So, sorry about the, the kitty. Um, I thought that was a beautiful, beautiful... Um, example of <laughs> of why you might want to write, market, and publish your book in four months. Because the more books you complete, the better you get at your craft. <laughs> so those are the whys. Now let's get to the hows. So how how can you do that? Because it's not like it's it's not like it's this easy thing to do. It's not like oh no challenge at all. Just do it in four months. Easy peasy. We know that you can write, we know that you can write like the whole NaNoWriMo thing, 50,000 50, words in one month. So we know that you can get the quantity, but what about the quality? How can you keep a really good quality book and get it out in four months? Well, the first thing is, it's kind of like, it's kind of like, I'm going to say it's kind of like with exercising, right? The, the, it's easier if you have some community and accountability, <laughs> and the right tools, okay? So the first thing you're gonna need in the how to do it is you're gonna need some community. You're going to need, and what we call them in, in All Writers Welcome in the Academy is we call them yaysayers versus naysayers. <laughs> so we've noticed that a lot of people have naysayers, like because writing is so solitary and it's so bold and courageous that you that a lot of writers have people in their lives who are naysayers and they're like, well, oh, you don't want to, you know, I don't know that your books, why should you be writing a book? Or when are you going to be done with your book? Or if you say I'm writing a book, they're like, well, haven't you been writing that book for like a month? <laughs> and you're like, yeah, but it takes more time. You've got naysayers and it's, um, it can be a real challenge, right? Like 
trying to keep your motivation in the face of these naysayers. Well, if you have a good community like the All Writers Welcome Facebook group and many other Facebook groups, community can keep you going when you're when you're having a challenging time. And that's what we call them, yaysayers. Yaysayers. <laughs> <laughs> so, so having some yaysayers on your side will help you to keep your momentum during that four months. The other thing that can really help is accountability. So that's where community also helps. Okay. So if you have accountability, like you're meeting with somebody once a week to say, okay, how far have I gotten? <laughs> What's, you know, and keeping you on track for doing what you need to do. Accountability is, I, I am in like three or four different accountability groups for, for projects in my life right now because I am committed to moving forward. And I know that if I don't have to meet with somebody, then I can procrastinate on the thing <laughs> and maybe not get it done. But if every week I have to be there saying, yep, I did that chapter. <laughs> and they're going to be like, yeah, I did too. That's a huge factor in being able to complete something in four months because especially this kind of challenging creative project is having that accountability and people that keep you on track. Um, like I said, it's like working out. Like if you know, if you say to somebody, hey, I'll meet you at the gym at six o'clock, you know, every, every Tuesday night and then you don't show up to the gym, no, you're going to show up to the gym <laughs> because they're going to be there waiting for you. And that's the power of accountability is getting you to where you need to go, where you want to go, but maybe have a challenging time doing it, you know, on your own. But community and accountability take care of that for you. The other thing to help you write, market, and publish your book in four months that I don't know if people think about this are, are tools. <laughs> having the right tools. So what do I mean by that for writing? Well, I mean, like, do you have a strategic revising plan? Like I had never even considered having a kind of revising plan <laughs> until I was partner. I've partnered with Megan. If you guys talk to Megan about revising, she has this brilliant, brilliant way of revising where it's this top down. So you don't revise something that you end up cutting later and and so instead of it being months and months and months and months of revising, you can get it done really quickly because you're doing, you're not wasting any time on stuff that doesn't, that you're, you know, that you're revising and then cutting out later. I had never even considered a strategic revising plan. Also, if you know, if you have the tools that you know, you have good beta readers, <laughs> right? In the academy, we have a beta reading course. And so everybody in the Academy is becoming an amazing beta reader. I'm kind of mentioning this Academy, but I'll, I'll tell a little bit later, but I'm saying if you have the tools, whether or not you're in an Academy, if you have the right tools to help you, um, write and market and publish more efficiently, <laughs> it goes a lot faster. So, so I know Megan has, and, and she's the one I have the most experience with, but you can get these tools anywhere. But Megan has these tools for create a character-based conflict. <laughs> and she just takes you through a, a worksheet where you can do that. It's, I'm like, oh, like she actually helps you and gives you the tools to write more efficiently. It's incredible. Um, the other thing for the marketing part is if you have a marketing calendar, like the tool to make it more efficient is to have a marketing calendar where you know exactly what you need to do throughout the four months in advance. So you're not wasting any time. Like, should I do this? Should I do that? No, you've got the tool, the exact tool that you need. So you're not wasting any time because right. Four months is, <laughs> I, hi kitties. Four months is a quick, <laughs> you know, it's a fast pace. And so you have to be efficient in order to get it done. Right. So, um, so those are some of the things community and accountability and having the right tools can make it possible for you to write a good, good book in four months. And 
yes, I am going to bring up <laughs> how you can get the, the community and accountability and tools if you're interested. But you guys, you know you can find that out there. It's the internet. You know you can find it if you need it. But if you like the kind of tools that I'm mentioning or if you've gotten some value from Megan and I here in the group or if you just want to check it out and see how, because we actually have created a calendar, a four-month calendar week by week about how to write and market and publish your book in four months. And um, we are doing a training on how to do that. We'll go through week by week. Um, we have that training this week. <laughs> so if you go to allwriterswelcome.com slash book, because that's what's important, right, is the book. So allwriterswelcome.com slash book, you can sign up to attend that training and we will actually go through week by week how you can write, market, and publish your book. A really good book, not just like some kind of, eh, not, we're not, we're not sacrificing quality for this book, but, um, but we are saying, hey, let's complete it. If your goal is to complete your book and get it out there, or if your goal is to really improve your craft by doing more and more books, um, you might want to come check out the, our Write Market and Publish Your Book in Four Months training because where we go through that calendar. And again, you can go see the calendar or you can go to the training with us at allwriterswelcome.com slash book. And, um, and on that training, we will actually give you the calendar so that you can just take that with you. Right. And, uh, yeah. And so I just want to have that for people's mindset, for those people who you're like, are going to like, I'm going to spend years making my book. I'm actually totally fine with that. <laughs> but for those of you who are in a space that you're like, I just want to get this done. I've been working on this for a long time or yeah. Whatever, whatever kind of space you're in that you're like, yeah, this sounds good to me. I welcome you to come to the training. Allwriterswelcome.com slash book. And I'm having some trouble loading my comments. <laughs> I've only got just a couple of comments, so I can't see the questions. I don't know exactly what's happening. But if you guys have had any questions, I will get to them afterwards. <laughs> yeah, I only have three comments. Hi, Shauna. <laughs> Hi, Christian. Hi, Megan. <laughs> and those are the only comments I've got. So I apologize for this hiccup with the questions and not being able to answer them. But I'm really excited to hopefully see you guys this week on the training. And then, um, yeah, and good luck. Good luck to all of you. You guys are so brave. You know how much I love writers. And I'm so passionate about you guys and your books and your work and your writing. So good luck to all of you. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. And hopefully I will see you this week. Bye.